Hey folks, CNT Mia here. Uh, doing a little short how-to video on the 130 Blade 130X. Uh, this is how-to video is going to show you how to get in programming mode to program your game settings on your heli, aileron, uh, elevator, and also rudder, which I went in and set my rudder up. I had a little wag and a little bounce or stop bounce whenever it came to a stop from doing pirouettes or uh, doing any kind of um, hard moves like TikToks or whatever, had a little bounce. Went in last night and programmed it. So went out this morning in the rain, and a little bit of rain we are having and got it done. So this is going to be a tutorial on how to do it. First of all, you want to set your throttle curves. If you got, if you put a throttle curve in, and uh, uh, if people who do like capsules, you set your cap, uh, throttle curve at a flat zero, so it will be dead on the sticks. First, you want to go back in there and program back your linear curve and your throttle curve. All right, first thing first, you're going to turn, put the stick up all the way to 100%. So you put the stick up all the way to 100%. Bear with for a minute while I plug this battery up. And as you plug the battery up, what it's going to do is going to beep and then go solid. All right. Then it went through its uh, little programming thing. So let's go back and show you again in case that didn't show up on video. All right. So let me get back out of programming mode. back in the program mode. Pull the stick all the way up to 100% throttle. Plug it in. You got a blue solid light. Wait a minute. And then it go through its little sequences. Alright. Red is going to be uh, aileron if I'm not mistaken. And green is going to be elevator, and blue is going to be rudder. So to change those, see I got red there. So to change it, you go to elevator and pull down, and there you green, and that's elevator. Elevator settings for it. All right, <clears throat> and to pull pull down again. You in rudder. And see, as you see there, I had already preset mine. The light that's not, not the light that's blinking fast, but the light that's blinking slow is the rudder settings. So to change them, for decreasing, you go aileron left. For increasing, you go aileron right. So if you're getting like a hard wag, or hard bounce when you're doing TikToks or power, or power flipping, you know, certain kind of maneuvers that, that puts a lot on the tail and it's getting that bounce. I, I would take it aileron left to take it out of, uh, to uh, take the uh, head and hold off of the, the head and hold down a little bit. Um, if it's not holding and you, and it's, it's not doing what it needs to do, I would go aileron right. To bump it up. So mine, I went down six times. So I went one, two, three, and so forth uh, to do to get it down. So then you go back, you know, if you need to turn it up, you go do it one at a time and like put it in the hover and see how it does. All right. And to get out of programming, all right. So just simply. Bear with, unplug the battery while the stick is still up, and then put the stick back down, then plug it back up, and you're out of programming. All right, folks. This was just a short tutorial on how to get into your programming settings. I will send a link. Those who are not on Heli Freak, I will send put a link on Heli Freak to show. 
I mean, on um, YouTube, at the bottom of my YouTube page to show where you can get this information from. And as I always say, God is good all the time. Team T out.